Hi, my name is April Sharman and I'm from the design team at Morris & Co, here to share with you our latest collection of haberdashery fabrics, created in partnership with Free Spirit. The collection is called Orkney and it's inspired by Mae Morris, who was William Morris's daughter. Although William Morris is an icon in the arts and crafts movement, Mae Morris is known for her embroidery and people take inspiration from the work that she created today. So it's really nice to have that spin on the collection. William Morris once said, have nothing in your house that you do not know to be useful or believe to be beautiful. And that's something that we live by today as custodians of the brand. And the partnership with Free Spirit is really nice because they respect our values in terms of embracing creativity and the heritage, which is so important to us. So let's have a look at the collection in further detail. The name is called Orkney and the fresco colour palette is inspired by the area called Orkney, which is ancient land in northern eastern Scotland. This design here is called Malsetta. It's inspired by the Kelmscott hangings created for Malsetta House in Scotland and it features a fruit tree with birds and flowers. Will make a really lovely feature piece on any project. This design is called Oak. It's inspired by the archive design Acorn and it has multi-directional oak leaves. Makes a great coordinate to the collection. We have it in this saffron colourway and the bottle green with indigo. Here we have Seasons by May. It's inspired by the original hanging designed and most likely stitched by May Morris called Spring and Summer in around 1895. It features mirrored parakeets, tulips and rosebuds. We have it in this colourway here with the creamy background and then this indigo colourway, which is very iconic for Morris because he used indigo discharge dyes in his practice. This design is called Theodosa. It's inspired by the hangings at Kelmscott House, which was the Morris family home based in the Cotswolds. It makes a great multi-directional accent. We have it in this colourway and the crimson one. So they both do very different jobs. This design is called Mallow. It features Mallow hibiscus. You can see it at the, on the walls of Standon House in Sussex. We have it in this colourway and then the blue colourway here. Both lovely. This design here is called Brophy. It's a design that was originally created by Andrew Brophy, arts and crafts designer. We actually kept the original trellis within the design. It was originally a ceiling paper, but we changed the flowers in here that were designed by Mae Morris. It's nice to have a trellis, more structured design within the collection. And then we have this more organic layout here for the design Wilhelmina. The nice forest green colour featuring acanthus leaves and honeysuckle, which are botanicals that Morris uses in many of his designs. So we have it in this colourway. And this one here with the linen background, which is very pretty. This design double bow came from our archive. It's got little dots in the background, which is nice to have that extra detail and it features acanthus leaves. 
And lastly, we have lemon tree. So this was inspired by the design fruit, which is one of William Morris's most loved wallpapers. We took the fruit out of it and we added in blossoms. So a real variety within the collection overall. And I'm sure there's many creative things you can do. Um, if you're like me and you've been at home recently, I've been really embracing the creativity. I've made cushions for my house and reupholstered my piano stool. I've noticed there's lots of projects that you can download from the Free Spirit website as well. So that's all very exciting. And it's been nice to see people taking simple pieces of fabric and developing masks and scrubs for key workers along the country. So I really look forward to hearing your feedback and very excited to share this collection with you. I hope that you like it. Thanks very much.